I'm here today to talk to you about JDAX line of HS1R combination barcode RFID scanners. This is the HS1R right here. It reads both barcodes and RFID. Designed for healthcare applications. And today we're gonna to simulate a use at a hospital point of care. Now hopefully if the, you can see the inset in the screen, that's a simulation of a vital signs monitor in a hospital. Uh, the idea is here is that you have a clinician, the doctor or nurse or a healthcare worker in a hospital, they already usually have a badge that they use around the hospital to badge themselves into different areas of the hospital. And it's really nice if they could use that same badge to enable themselves to log into a device like a vital sign monitor or an ultrasound. Well, why do they want to do that? There's, there's several reasons. One is they want to make sure that the person is authorized to use that device. It's not just somebody off the street that comes in and starts using it. Two, they want to protect the patient's HIPAA, the healthcare protected information, so that, again, someone off the street can't just go in and see it. And, and the third reason is it's really nice to have a badge login so that the clinician doesn't have to use a manual login, which takes time, say, to, say to put in a password in on a device. And it also can, can uh, spread hospital-acquired infections from, from room to room, patient to patient. So what we're going to do here, again, this is the, the badge, and I'm going to just go up to my, my HS1R. The HS1R is always looking for RFID codes in the background, and that beep indicated that it read the RFID code, and you can always still see on the screen that the screen opened up when it saw that this was an authorized clinician to access that device. Well, the fact that it's also a barcode reader now is I can go in and I have my patient, simulated patient here that I can read their wristband that identifies who the patient is. So we'll tie that patient's name and their medical record number and so on to their, to their information in the centralized hospital database. And the third thing I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna, I wanna administer this patient a drug. Well, I have two drugs here. I have epinephrine and ephedrine. They have similar names. You can, maybe you can see on the video that they, they look very similar, the, the same color scheme and everything on these syringes. So I'm gonna read the epinephrine. Okay, you can see that was the wrong drug. But that patient really needs to have the ephedrine, and I got an error here. So this is a visual error on the screen. It also could be an audible error to really make really clear to that that doctor or nurse that that's the wrong stuff for this patient. So now I'm going to take and read the correct one. I'm going to hit hit a rescan drug to do that, and and now I, you can see I've got the right drug here, ephedrine. So. Really what we're demonstrating here is that you can use our HS1R to, to do several things. First of all, you have two devices in one. So connected to that, that healthcare device, again, whether it's a vital signs monitor, an ultrasound, any number of things. But now you have one device, you have less cables, less clutter, and so on. Uh, number two, we're allowing secure access to that device using the, the credentials that that healthcare provider already has. And three, we're protecting the patient's five rights, right? The five rights being making sure it's the right patient with the right drug at the right time, in the right dosage through the right route. And that's it for our HS1R. Thank you for listening.